Most e-commerce brands know that they should be sending more email campaigns every month. They understand they convert more prospects by continuing to nurture new subscribers after their welcome series is done. And they understand that, of course, they drive more repeat purchases by staying top of mind for their existing customers every week. And yet, every month, they don't send enough emails to accomplish either of these things or maximize the ROI that they should be seeing from Klaviyo. And speaking of someone who was in their shoes, it's not because they're lazy. It's because once you've sent that new product launch email and maybe that discount email that you do every month, you're either out of ideas about what you should be sending to your list every week, or you have the ideas, but you simply don't have the time with the million other things that you need to do as a small brand. So today I'm going to remove every single one of those businesses excuses, and I'm going to show you how I plan, write, design, and schedule 12 campaigns using a platform that I built called LT. The reason that most brands underperform in their email marketing and see low revenue coming from their campaigns is very simple. It's either a lack of bandwidth or it's a lack of strategy. LT was built to solve both and do one thing exceptionally well, generate max revenue from your email campaigns and deliver the highest possible ROI on your Klaviyo bill. LT connects directly to your Shopify account and your Klaviyo account. It learns everything it needs to know about your products, your customers, your seasonality, and then it builds out a complete campaign calendar for you. And if you're maybe thinking, well, I can already do that with ChatGPT or I already do do that with ChatGPT, this is not ChatGPT. Every single campaign is planned, strategized, copywritten, and designed specifically based on the strategies and frameworks that we've developed at Dispatch, my agency, working with eight-figure brands over the last five years, sending over a billion emails and generating over $50 million in email marketing revenue, running hundreds of A-B tests, and learning everything there is to know about what actually drives conversions for e-commerce brands, regardless of the niche. So we are in LT, and this is the brand profile section. So this entire section fills itself out and basically takes two minutes to set up. So all you have to do is basically sync your Shopify integration, which takes one button click, you set up your Klaviyo integration, again, one button click, and then you put in your website URL. LT conducts an entire website analysis, just like a high level email marketing manager and fills out all of our info over here. For this example, we're going to be using a brand that I made up called Plant Nation. I generated a logo with ChatGPT right over here. And basically we're going to see, we have our mission statement. We have our target audience demographic info. We have everything we need to know about the brand theme that's pulling from our URL. And then we have our product categories, our unique selling points and brand voice examples examples so that copy is on point and aim to convert specifically for your brand. So with our brand profile section done, I'm going to head over to our calendar and we're going to work on filling out our November calendar in this video. So I'm going to go ahead and click our add emails button and I'm going to go ahead and select November 1st to November 30th. And we could select any range we want here, but I'm going to go ahead with full month of November. And then we're going to say we want to go with three emails per week. Could say that we prefer to send emails on specific days if you do for your brand. But for the sake of this example, I'm going to let LT decide what's best for me. And here in our custom instructions is where so much of the magic is going to stem from. So one of the biggest things that we do at my agency dispatch is we take a deep interest and ownership in understanding what is happening at the brand in order to mix that information with our frameworks of what is going to convert best and build a calendar that is completely custom to the brand while also incorporating what a top performing campaign calendar has. So under product launches, I'm going to say that we do have a new yellow pot that is releasing on November 9. Now for promotions, November is Black Friday. So I'm going to say Black Friday site-wide 20% off sale starting November 20. And then I'll also say that we're going to do a plus 24 hour flash sale on November 26 for 25% off site wide. Now, LT is going to take all this information and work it in, and you're going to see how it does this in the calendar generation. All right, next in terms of the product focus. So, do you have specific products or collections that you want to focus? Maybe you have inventory that's sitting on the shelves. In our next generation of LT, we're actually going to analyze your inventory and be able to suggest products that you should be promoting based on an inventory analysis of your Shopify store. But if there's ever anything that you specifically want to promote, you can fill that in right over here. So, I'll leave this as no for now. And then if there's any other specific email instructions that we'd like to provide, then we could do that in this section. Literally anything that you would want. So imagine you had an email marketing strategist working for you and you want to let them know about something you want to see. That's exactly how you would treat LT. And just like that, we're done over here. So I'm going to click generate emails. And right now, LT is taking everything that it knows about the brand. It's taking everything it knows about our products, our customer base, what's coming up in November that we just explained. And it's specifically putting a calendar together that is optimized to 
drive as much conversion as possible. And just like that, our entire calendar for the month is done. So looking at the campaigns that LT is suggesting right over here, let's go ahead and take a look. So if we open up the first one, we see that the title of the campaign is Cozy Up Your Space, November Warm Up Collection. We have our description, start November right with cozy indoor pieces perfect for the season, feature warm tone furniture and comfort items to create inviting spaces as temperatures drop. And then we have our section where LT as a strategist is going to explain to you why this campaign is actually going to work and drive conversions. So scheduled at the start of the month to capture early November shopping behavior and seasonal transition needs, highlight warm, cozy pieces that align with November's cooler weather patterns and indoor comfort priorities. Like that makes perfect sense. And this is exactly the type of campaign that I would put onto a calendar. So LT is letting us know that this is a collection showcase campaign, which is one of the top performing event types. And then LT is letting us know the products that it is suggesting we feature in this collection showcase and in this campaign. So in my Shopify store that I integrated, we have plants and then we also have home goods. So here it's showing that we're going to have the knitted throw pillows, the pink armchair, vanilla candle and yellow sofa, which all completely align with the strategy that it presented me with. And if we click on this, it's actually a drop down. So because it's synced with Shopify, you can actually select the exact products that you want to see in this campaign. So let's say we want to see the clay plant pot instead of the vanilla candle. We can remove the vanilla candle and we can put in the clay plant pot right over here. Now we're ready to add this to calendar because this looks great. Now let's take a look at a high level at the rest of the campaigns that it is suggesting throughout November. So next up, transform your space statement furniture spotlight. Discover how the right furniture piece can completely transform your room. Showcase premium sofas and seating that serve as stunning focal points for any living space. And then in the why this works is positioned on a Tuesday to drive midweek engagement and feature high value furniture pieces targets customers seeking room transformation solutions during the prime home improvement season. So again, this is the exact type of campaign we would suggest for our clients at Dispatch. And the reason why is because it blends in content that is engaging, seasonal, and also has a CTA to go shop, which you'll see a bit more clearly when we develop the copy and the design. So if you're sending emails right now that are basically just saying, here's a product, go shop, here's a product, go shop, here's a product, go shop, that is why your campaigns are not driving high click rates and high conversion. You need to be sending emails that your subscribers actually want to open that position you as an expert in your domain. And it's going to be providing helpful tips and insights and education in your subscribers inboxes. And then being able to really tastefully tie that content into your products with CTAs to go shop. So this looks great. Add it to calendar. Next up, new product alert. So we told LT about our yellow pot. And sure enough, on the 8th, LT is suggesting that we actually have a teaser campaign, which is again, from a strategy standpoint, a great idea. So whenever you're launching a new product, you don't want to just come out of nowhere and say, here's this yellow pot, go buy it. You want to get people excited about this product so that when you do drop it, you've already presented education on what it is, why people should want it, enticing imagery, let's say. And then when it drops, they are ready to go shop. So this is a teaser campaign scheduled one day before the November 9 product launch as specified by the user, aka me. It creates anticipation and builds excitement for the new Yellow Pot release while encouraging early interest. So as you can see, before I even read that, it basically read my mind and described exactly why you should be sending a teaser campaign. And then under related products, it pulled the yellow watering can because that was the closest thing that it could find to the Yellow Pot. In this example, the Yellow Pot actually isn't on Shopify yet, but what I'll show you is we can have this clay plant pot, which is going to come in a yellow variant. So that's what we're talking about. And I'll show you exactly how we can work that in right after. Click add to calendar. And then on the 9th, we have our product launch. So now available, go buy the yellow pot. Launch day campaign for the new yellow pot as specified by user for November 9th. Focus on immediate availability and encourages customers to purchase this exciting new product release. Add to calendar. Then we have a follow-up campaign on the 12th. So another thing that you don't want to do is just say, here's the new yellow pot, here's our new product, go buy it, and then just move on to talking about something else. If you're putting all that effort into creating a new product, stocking on the shelves, and then selling it, you need to actually put the marketing behind it. And if there are different angles that you can talk about the product in, different unique selling points about that product specifically, then you should have additional emails that really provide more value to that product and give them a reason why they should shop it. So in this example, LT is suggesting that we send a email that is saying your new yellow pot styling tips and plant pairings 99 of brands that i audit and that i talk to what they would do in this situation is basically just resend 
the same email. What LT is suggesting we do is provide styling tips. So here's how this can actually fit into your home and here's why you should buy it. We'll go ahead and add this to calendar, antique charm. So mid-November campaign targeting customers seeking unique character-rich furniture pieces, position to complement existing campaigns while filling the weekly frequency. Here we have antique charm, timeless storage solutions, add character to your bedroom with authentic antique furniture. Makes sense. And now we come up to Black Friday. So Black Friday is starting on the 20th and on the 18th, we're going to have our sale preview. So our teaser campaign positioned a few days before Black Friday sale is specified by the user, builds anticipation and encourages customers to prepare their shopping list for the upcoming 20% site wide promo. Add to calendar. All right. So now that our strategy for the month of November is done, let's go ahead and move on to our copywriting design and scheduling of our emails. So first up, we have our collection showcase on the first, and I'm simply going to go ahead and click generate copy. Now, just like the campaign strategy side of things, LT is going to take all of the top performing frameworks in terms of copywriting that we have found, and it's going to apply it so that this email is written in a way that is most likely to drive as much conversion as possible for this specific campaign for your brand. So LT is going to present the whole layout for the campaign. So we're going to have our brand's logo right at the top, which you'll see in the design. And then in the hero, we have our title or our header, which you can say cozy up your space this November, our subtitle, transform your home into a warm haven. And then our text, as temperatures drop, create the perfect indoor retreat with our curated collection of cozy furniture and comfort pieces designed to make your space feel like home. It's letting us know that there's going to be a lifestyle image here. Now, if there was a different lifestyle image that you wanted to see, you could simply describe what that's going to be because LT is literally just going to design whatever we have right over here. And if you want to edit the text, you can either do that yourself right over here by editing, or you can talk to LT like it's a copywriter and give it revision notes, and it'll make those revisions exactly as you'd like them. So I can say, make this more concise. And just like that, we have our more concise body copy, which again is rooted in our brand voice. We have our CTA button where that button's actually going to link and then the button styling. So really all you need to do is look at the copy, review it as you would if you were working with an agency or, or a freelancer who's writing your copy for you, and then simply approve it when you're done. And here quickly, you can see that the next section's email is going to be a product showcase. So it's going to show those November warm up essentials and those different products that we want to show the value proposition. So why should you choose plant nation and then we're gonna have our footer at the bottom so this copy looks great to me and i'm gonna go ahead and design our email next i'm gonna just click generate email this can take up to three minutes and again this is going to be done completely based off of our principles and our frameworks on what goes into email design that actually gets people to click and buy at dispatch we have a 28 point checklist that all of our designers follow when they're creating emails for clients. And LT has been trained on this exact checklist as well. Now, before you see this design output, you might say, Elliot, I've gone to the Dispatch website and Dispatch's emails look way better than this. I don't know when you're watching this video, but we are currently in October 2025 and the state of AI graphic design is nowhere near the state of human design. So what that means is for our eight figure brand partners who have legitimate eight figure brands that need to be very elevated, they still need the human touch on strategy, on copy and design. LT is built for smaller brands who want to get to eight figures and do not have the resources to work with expert humans at this point. So LT's promise to you as a small brand is that it is going to drive incremental revenue for you. The strategy, the copy, and the design are all going to be more optimized to drive conversions for e-commerce emails compared to whatever you're currently building yourself in Klaviyo or with the help of ChatGPT. All right, so our first design is done and here is what LT put together for us. So cozy up your space this November. We have our logo right up here. This is a very clean hero module that will drive clicks. So number one, like amazing lifestyle imagery right here that is exactly highlighting the strategy and the copy of this email. So it's very unlikely that if Plant Nation had a real brand and wanted to send an email to cozy up your space this November, that it would have an asset like this ready to go that actually had warm lighting, autumn tones, and like was perfectly aligned with the strategy and featured the pot that we're talking about in the email right here. So the important thing to know about LT's design is it's going to take the products from your Shopify catalog. It's going to take the images and it's going to work them into these scenes that's going to align perfectly with your copy. One of the other super important elements 
that you need if you want to drive engagement and clicks from your emails is good white space and content hierarchy. So as you can see here, we have our super clean header, subheader and body copy and CTA right over here, which basically allows anyone to scroll through this email and basically see the high level point of what we're talking about here and then click out to the site easily when something catches their eye. Now in this email specifically, these are quite similar in terms of image slices. And from a simple standpoint of like engagement, this is so much more engaging than a basic Klaviyo template. It's not even close. So similar to what I pointed out with the copy, if we want to edit the design at all, we can simply leave revision notes the same way that we would for a graphic designer. And we can say something like make the couch white over here because maybe that will make the pillows stand out more. And just like magic, everything else in the email is the same, but the couch went from yellow to white. And one of the great things here as well is because these are image slices and because these do have to be linked up, as you saw in the copy section, we're already suggesting which links make sense to drive conversions for each of these CTAs in these sections. So if I click on this shop now button, it's actually going to take me to the website. All right, so I'm really happy with this design. I think it's gonna drive conversion. Next, we're ready to actually schedule this email in Klaviyo. So when we get to our export section, this looks exactly like what you would see in Klaviyo with all the same settings. So we can name our campaign. Let's go with cozy up your space. And this is gonna be the campaign name in Klaviyo. We can go with the subject line for simplicity can have this right here. The preview text will say the perfect fall products you need. We'll set the from email, the from name, who's it coming from, the reply to emails. This is all pre-populated based on your Klaviyo account. But of course, if you ever want to change it, you could. The list and segments are pulled directly from your Klaviyo account. So you can select whatever exists in Klaviyo already right here. So I'll go with our master email list segment. Do we want to exclude anyone? Maybe we want to exclude anyone who's bounced. And then on the schedule side, we have this scheduled for November 1st. And then and the time, I think this should go out somewhere around 6 p.m. to kind of align with the warm lighting that we have in the in the email. We can select if we want smart sending, if we want to send in recipients local time, we can export it and we're all done. So this is preparing to schedule in Klaviyo. We can now open it in Klaviyo and we can see right here, it's scheduled. Now let's go ahead and actually take a look at the campaign in Klaviyo. And we can see just like it was in LT, it's right here. Every time I see this, I'm still in genuine shock at how good this quality is and how easy it was to create this. All right, so one campaign is done. Obviously that took a while because I was walking you through every single step, but now I'm ready to absolutely breeze through the rest of these. So I'm gonna get to work. This is probably gonna take me six or seven minutes to just complete the rest of these. And just like that, if we go over to Klaviyo now, we can see every single one of our November campaigns is scheduled right over here. So in just a couple of minutes, completed all of our campaigns, strategy, copy, and design, and scheduled in Klaviyo. And as if this wasn't magical and good enough, the next development that we're working on in LT is to actually understand what your top performing campaigns are. And because we now have all of the context about every single element that is going into each of these campaigns, when we're able to assess the performance of what performed well, we know exactly why it performed well, and we're then able to incorporate those insights when we're planning out next month's campaign calendar. So that means on top of everything else LT is going to be doing, it's also going to be making sure that your campaigns are improving every month, and most importantly, generating more and more revenue every month. So most brands lose thousands every single month because they're just too resource constrained, unfortunately, to send several good campaigns per week. It's really that simple. That is how you maximize your ROI on Klaviyo. You send several good campaigns campaigns per week. If that's been a problem for you, it can now literally be solved in less than 15 minutes per month. You can try it free at the link in the description, lt.ai, no credit card required, completely free. Go ahead, connect your Shopify and your Klaviyo account and see what LT would send for your brand starting as soon as tomorrow.